You gorgeous lot. Somnium here with episode number 71 of Something Else. And uh, coming up in today's show, we have uh, Bangalangs from uh, ATFC, Vanilla Race, Free Jack, Chris Lake, and loads more. We also catch up with Henry Hacking in Say Something. But uh, we kick things off with a rather wonderful producer and chap and a rather wonderful song. It is Michael Calfan with a track called On You. It's the Avion Remix.
show with wonderful chaps um we've got two here now in the background stonebridge featuring uh Therese with uh, take me away the 2018 esquire remix and then uh, up next another lovely chap as well gosh we're having a big love we might as well just get a load of beanbags in the middle of the room and just all have a big hug it's uh, atfc and david penn with a track called hip cats you are me somnium and this is something else
This is madness. More lovely chaps <laughs> in the background. Vanilla Race, lovely chap. K and K, not met them, but I'm sure they're lovely. With a track called Hole and Bounce, uh, it's the Angelo uh, Ferrari remix. I'm sure he's lovely as well. Up next, um, two of my uh, good mates actually. They've had a great success with this track. Uh, it's uh, they've been smashing it. Uh, it's uh, Holophonic with a track called Spaceship featuring uh, Barber or BX Arba. I can never tell you properly with it. People with different letters in. I couldn't talk. My name's got a three in it. Somnium. Uh, anyway, Tolophonic with a crack called Spaceship. It's a cracker. Uh, do stream by purchase wherever you hear it because I do like those guys and uh, they do actually run around for Christmas dinner, so I have to be nice to them. This is something else. Small superstition. Interplanetary mission. And I'm trying to get closer to you It's so hard from a distance You're a million, million, trillion miles away With a million, trillion light years in the way And I know you said you needed more space But the sky will shine as bright if you're away If I could be in a spaceship Fly to you, baby Fly to you, baby Whenever he made you So get heaven on the phone Tell them that they lost one She ain't coming home My telescope is me looking at your dome I hope it won't be long catch up with someone in this. Say something. This week's guest, I welcome a man I met on, uh, well, getting on for 10 years now ago in Dubai. Uh, back then, he was one half of the Beat Thieves and he was booked to play at a little old club called The Apartment. Uh, in Dubai that I run my nights at but he think he plays for another promoter but anyway that, that I digress uh, 10 years later he signed to EDX's Pink Star label on his own uh, please welcome to Say Something it is Henry Hacking hello Henry 
how are you and what are you up to? Hello, buddy. Yeah, all good, thanks. Uh, very busy here. Got loads of releases planned for this year, uh, kicking off uh, next week with my first track called Lifting. Uh, that's out on EDX's label. And then off the back of that, a few weeks afterwards, uh, I've just finished a remix for uh, Harrison. And then there's just plans to keep pumping out loads of music, loads of good house music this year. That's the focus. Tour-wise, uh, my wife actually is about to give birth in a few weeks' time, so I'm taking a little bit of time out just to spend it with her and uh, our second baby, uh, which is kind of a sensible thing to do. Um, and then I'm back on the road uh, from about June time off to Asia. I've already got a couple of gigs confirmed in Bali and then off to Vietnam, my stomping ground called Camellia Lounge. That's in Hanoi. And also plans to be back at Ministry of Sound in London in July, then heading off to Ibiza with Pucker Up to do some of their parties out there for the summer. So uh, yeah, a few things bubbling away. Um, all good at the moment. Fantastic. So basically you're waiting for a massive drop from your wife. Uh, <laughs> It's pardon the pun. <laughs> yeah, yeah, biggest job of 2018. <laughs> <laughs> well, Henry, so that we know you a little bit better, can I ask you some random questions? You could try. Okay. Have you ever turned up to anything a day late or a day early? Uh, you know what? My timekeeping is probably the greatest timekeeper on earth. So it's very rare that I turn up early or late for anything. And I get really frustrated, even with my wife, uh, just trying to get out the door or anything, wherever we've got to be. If it's at that time, I have to be there for that time. I, I, I don't know what it is, some kind of crazy OCD sort of thing about timings. Um, same with catching flights, same with getting on a train. I have to be there at the exact time. I, I get all flustered and all panicked otherwise. So it, just, it, just, it just doesn't work for me. Now you need to have words with uh, your, new, your, uh, your, your new child as well, because uh, you said you had a bit of a bit of a worry today it was going to come early you need to have a word with him go no no get back in you're not you're too early <laughs> okay next question where is the most random place you've woken up most random place is probably uh nothing too crazy i woke up on the floor in a shower that's quite crazy is it waking up in a shower i mean no one goes to a shower just to have a little nap People go to beds. I suppose you're right. Yeah, it was out in Vietnam in uh, Ho Chi Minh. All I remember is uh, is vaguely getting back to the hotel room and uh, and then waking up. Uh, the shower was still on as well. Um, so I was just laying there on the floor, just in a sort of crumpled heap. And I bet your fingers are going to look like your newborn baby's fingers are all wrinkled and kind of... They still are. And that was like two years ago. Yeah. <laughs> and final question. Can you impersonate anyone famous? Uh, yeah, I can actually. Yeah. Um, go on. David Attenborough. Um, oh, yes. That's kind of the only one that I... Well, I say I can, and I've been told I can. So if I do it now, and it doesn't sound good, then that's blowing my... Something I'm quite proud of. Let's give it a go. Go on. Here on the radio station is Henry Hacking speaking to David Newsom, and we're currently talking about the world's greatest impersonation of David Attenborough. <laughs> That's actually quite good. I, I, will, I will give that an 8 out of 10. Everywhere I go, I'll always stick a, if it's on holiday or wherever it is, I, and I get into a garden, I, I just waffle. I do a bit of David Attenborough. Um, yeah. If so, in doubt, uh, if you start to panic in a conversation, just whack out David Attenborough. As, as long as you can go out here, then you, 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 you're, you're, you're there. <laughs> God, I need to take you out more places. God, you'd, you'd, be, you'd be a great wingman. Fantastic. <laughs> Well, Henry Hacking, thank you very much for joining us. Before you go, do please leave us with a song you'd like to play, everyone. Mate, yeah, I'd love to. So you, this track, as I say, it's out next week, out on Monday. Uh, it's my brand new single called Lifting on Pink Star Records. Uh, make sure you go and grab it from Beatport um, or jump on Spotify uh, and give it a stream. Say something. Say something. Say something.
week's guest, Henry Hackey, for joining us. And that was his latest track called Lifting. It's out on the 12th of March on EDX's Pink Star recording. So uh, go buy, stream, etc., etc. Up next, it's Chris Lake featuring Alexis Roberts with Turn Off the Lights. You're with Somnium, and they're on something else.
these guys in the background it is uh, D-O-N-S or Don's um, and uh, they've uh, they've just released a track on a label called How Will I Know so go and buy that as well but they've also just uh, got this coming up it's uh, Don's and Shaheen featuring Shawnee B with Rolling Deep it's the uh, Styline remix and up next it's a Perfecto All Stars and Free Jack with Reach Up you're with me Somnium and this is Something Else
secrets or hand you the truth. I won't give you no alibi. Look at my face, you can read all about it. Whatever you lost, yeah, I hope that you found it. You are the prayer from my penny in the wishing well. Everybody wants to love somebody. Everybody wants to love somebody. And my heart's gonna say, oh no, I wouldn't sell. But my love don't come for free. And yeah, my heart's gonna say, oh no, I'm gonna kiss a chill. But I need some company. I need some company. with Heart for Sale. And up next, all the news you didn't need. News. Something going on. In the latest in line of club nights themed around cult British documentary figures, following uh, David Attenborough's Jungle Boogie Nights, there is now a Louis Theroux themed party operating under the title... <laughs> I do actually like this. we got to get through this. <laughs> Uh, this is starting at the O2 Academy in Islington in London in March. Uh, now, it's the O2 Academy, and I guarantee it won't be full of, like, sweaty ravers or anything. It'll be full of middle-aged mums called Sharon from Lewisham, uh, not realising what they're walking into. Uh, where do I get tickets? That's all I want to know. Uh, I love a bit of South London single mum. Seth Troxler will be creating visual artist Scooter Luforgia's London debut later this month at Shoreditch's Jealous Gallery. The secret showcase titled The Odyssey will present paintings and prints by Laforge. Go down if you want six hours of something repetitive, dark and boring. EDM supergroup The Swedish House Mafia has just updated its profile picture and cover photo on Facebook, which has sparked another round of rumours that they are going to uh, have a reunion gig in the coming months. Uh, the uh, the group, consisting of Axwell and Grosso and Steve Angelo, famously split after their last show in 2013. Rumours of a Swedish House Mafia reunion, blah, 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 blah. Literally, who cares about a Swedish House Mafia reunion? Axwell and Grosso still tour together, so it's a bit like... ABBA losing one of their B's and still touring together and then say they're getting a B back. It's still going to be ABBA. Either way, who cares? Something going on.
to end the show with three in a row um, featuring the second time in this show I mentioned uh, them earlier it's Don's D-O-N-S with uh, Alexandra Prince on the vocals with a track called Howl I know it's the Bakerloo remix and that's out on uh, my label Something Records do go buy it stream it enjoy it uh, have great pleasure from it then after that Michael Green with Can't Deny and then finally this Lockie with Losing My Religion featuring Pearl Anderson you have me Somnium it has been uh, something else and uh, you can find us on Spotify do just type in Somnium S-O-M-N 3-U-M or something else S-O-M-N apostrophe thing else and uh, you can uh, get all the tracks on the show we've got a big playlist up there and all that subscribe and uh, every week we update the tracks in Spotify you can also find us on iTunes as well well I'll see you the same time same place next week I've been Somnium this has been something else see ya something else